welcome back to my Amazon Live. This one's going to be pretty fun because I'm going to give my honest opinion on what I ordered versus what I've got. So I think that you guys are going to love this. Um, if you are new here, hit the follow plus button. Feel free to ask me any questions throughout the chat. Like I said, I'm here to give my honest opinion. And if we don't like something or we love it, I'll be sure to let you know. Okay. Um, let's just go ahead and get it out there. If you can see this, I have busted a blood vessel in my eye, so this one is pretty red. I have a feeling it's going to stay around for a while, so it's a little embarrassing, but we're working with it. So I wear these shades the majority of this time. Don't be shocked. Okay, so all of these items today are going to be under $50, which is amazing. So you can pretty much get one of everything if you want, at least the good stuff. So um, we got a few good things on here. Okay, thank you guys for following Alex, James, Jen. I'm glad you love the streams. I love doing them and I always have a good time, especially answering all of y'all's questions. Uh, you guys crack me up. So we're just going to kind of get into this since we have a lot to talk about. All right. So we're going to talk about this oversized button down situation. I know a lot of people are wearing them with jeans, um, jean shorts at least with like a tank underneath. So I actually really like this. I tried to copy her pose because it looked better like that than, um, you know, just pretty much closing it up because it looked like a man's shirt. But overall, I really did like the outfit. I think we have a uh, picture or video of that so we can show you guys what that looks like. Um, I like the beige. I think it looked really good. I also think you could possibly wear it as like a cover-up situation if you needed to. So there's that. Oh, thanks. So this tan is actually real for once. Um, okay, here we go. We have the shirt. Here I am embarrassing myself by modeling it. Okay, this is a, a good situation of what you ordered and what you got. <laughs> um, so yeah, I just paired it with a white tank and some jean shorts that I also have all that in the carousel and under $50. So I do really like that. It was good. Good quality. Um, thank you. This is my closet and I'm glad uh, you guys love it because so do I. I never want to like leave this room. Even though this mirror that I have in here, which is probably why we never like take mirror selfies. It's like, it's like a mirror that makes you look you know, three inches shorter and 10 pounds heavier. So I don't know how the heck to get this mirror out, but we gotta figure, I need a skinny mirror because it's stumping me out. Okay, how are you doing, Emma? Um, I'm doing well. I'm actually in the mix of planning a surprise trip for Hudson because we always do a little trip together. So I think um, he comes home this week and he's been at his dad's and I'm gonna surprise him and take him somewhere, so. Just a little vacation with us. Okay, I'm glad you guys are liking to see what outfits look like in real life because this next um, deep V bodysuit is very sexy. Um, everybody was trying to get me to wear it today, but I didn't want to like get shadow banned from Amazon, so I didn't do it. But it's definitely like a going out or, you know, something along those lines. Date night, if you're trying to get somebody's attention, this is what you're going to wear. So there I'm wearing it with the skirt that I also have on today. It's a little long for me. I am 5'3", uh, so if you are on the taller side, I think it's it would be perfect, but the quality is really nice. Um, as you can see, yeah, it looks like I work at Ruby Tuesdays, but <laughs> it's fine. Um, yeah, I would shorten this if I were to keep it. 
Okay, then we're gonna talk about these sleeveless ribbed body suits. Now, the cool thing about it is it comes in a pack of four. I love all of the colors on these. I think they're just a good basic neutral and the fact that they switch up the style, which I think is really nice. So I am wearing, um, I think one or two of these to kind of show you exactly what it looks like. Okay, who is that? I'm just kidding. She's out here catfishing people. Um, love the gray. This is with a like little tennis skirt that I popped on. I thought it looked cute for like, you know, if you're doing mom stuff or not, doesn't matter, uh, but still look chic. There I have it on with these jean shorts. Um, jean shorts, I hate those. Uh, I think that they the sizing was wrong but i have not got into you know where the button like comes way over here i don't know i have to keep that for the 20 something year olds because it's just not my vibe okay my favorite outfit from this haul i mean i'm gonna get down to it i'm gonna keep showing you there's there's a few good ones um and then there are some bad ones top Love that. Like I said, that's part of the pack of four. Um, so that's a good one. Please tell us what brand of extensions you have, how many packs, and what shade. Okay, Nikki, this is Great Links Extensions. <coughs> Only extensions I, I wear. As far as color goes, I do 10 packs of hair, which is actually not normal for anybody. But my real hair has so much body that it's the only way to make um, it blend because this is kind of like a little ball if you know um, my hair is extremely curly so it gets a lot of the uh, volume in there and then the shade we just end up buying like pretty much every shade of blonde and we mix it in there to match uh, my natural hair color I did a purple shampoo last night by Wella so I think it ashed it out a little bit because of uh, the summer and has been a little on the yellow side. Love you. Thank you. Okay, so let's get into this other top that's very sexy. Now, the fabric on this, I'm going to show you, but I will show you on too because uh, it is nice. It is like... You can see how thick this is so you don't have to worry about um you know wearing a bra even like a nipple cover or anything like that like this thing will cover it up not only that it does crisscross so you're you're getting pulled up too so you're getting a boob lift at the same time under fifty dollars okay yeah see whoa huh <laughs> I think I should wear that uh, when I go out with my husband and see if he can, you know, keep eye contact because that's a lot. The fabric is, is really nice on, on this um, top. Jean shorts, a little rednecky for me. Um, I think it's more of the color that I don't like. It's, it's just like that white wash. Now, if it was like a jean, possibly, but I just can't do like a bold top like that with I don't know like I think that would look good with like an ivory like trouser like pant kind of to class it up I mean we can't have the girls out and the buns out unless we're in a bikini everything is true to size um so yeah I didn't feel like anything I mean other than the jean shorts which what were we wearing a 25 um, and they were fine. I like hearing your opinion on these. I feel like I order from Amazon and it doesn't come the way that I thought it would look. Thank you for this. Oh, you're welcome. We can continue to do these. Um, I'm giving you my honest opinion. Like I said, so far, jean shorts are no. Um, we're, we're winning the game right here with the tops. So. And I know the pictures, I mean, first off, these models, uh, they look fantastic. So, um, it is definitely hard. Okay, this next little top is really cute because this is a color block uh, bodysuit. 
it's green, which I just think is a great color on any skin tone, uh, blonde, brunette, you name it. I just think it looks really cute and fun. Uh, pairs well with shorts or anything like that, just not the ones that I'm wearing. Can you guys tell that I really hate the shorts? Because I feel like that's all I've said. Um, love the top. I think it's super cute. It is a little um, thin, so I did wear uh, pasties with that. Um, I do not size up on bodysuits. I think we're wearing, what, small? Yeah. I normally do size up when it comes to, like, if it was like a sports bra or anything, I'll do medium. But for bodysuits, because of uh, my waist, I do small. Oh, okay, you guys are wondering why I don't like the shorts. Okay, like I said, it's just a little, like, rednecky to me. Like, um, the white wash, like, jean short and then the fray on the side. And I don't mind some of the low cut, but uh, the other ones were just too big. And the button was, like, way over on the other side. I can't get into that. Uh, yeah, do y'all see what I'm saying? I don't know. G shorts are hard. I mean, I always do Levi's or a Goldie or I don't even know what brand this is. They're under 50, so. Yeah, you can't have, you, Emily, you understand what I'm saying. I also love your makeup today. Very pretty, natural. How'd you do it today? So, um, today is Kind of like how I always do uh, Charlotte Tilbury, pretty much everything. I am wearing Armani foundation. Um, and then eyeshadow is Charlotte Tilbury, the one that I always do, which is all that's in my life. I know it if you need to know. Oh, thank you. Ace, that's sweet. Okay. Um, this little one shoulder cutout bodysuit, it's a white one. I kind of like it because it gives us a little more, um, well, there we are. <laughs> That's not me, <laughs> but, um, they got this girl on a thong over here. Uh, yeah, I like it because it's something a little more elevated than, see, that's fine. I like that. Then just a white, plain tank top. There I am trying to cover up my red eye. Y'all, this is this so cringe for me to watch myself do this. Um, but I'm just here to be honest. Okay. That's cute. I do like the top. 10 out of 10. And uh, good coverage. Wasn't thin. Um, I didn't have any issues with any of that. And I just wore like a little thin pasty with those. Okay, now we're going to move down to this button-down bodysuit. This is giving me, like, I don't know, Colorado vibes, uh, mountain girl. Um, yeah, kind of. It's cute. Looks great on her. Um, wouldn't be my top favorite, but in the right situation, like, if you wanted to, like, throw a little flannel on and like do the thing. Yeah. Love that. What bra do I wear? Okay, I don't, I don't ever wear bras, so I just do, God, I don't know the brand, but you can get them at like CVS or something. Um, you know, they come in the pink uh, little box and they're just the stick on. Uh, not the like paper ones, but like the silicone ones. And then I do the one that almost covers the whole entire thing versus like just the smaller ones. I don't know if I can say like nipple and stuff on here. So, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, okay. So here's one of my favorites. Uh, Jen, I know you asked which, uh, was my favorite. This is a square neck bodysuit. I think it's flattering on everyone. The color, I really love the color of this. I normally don't go to beige because I feel like everything about me is beige. Um, but, yeah. 
loved that. Made the girls look good. It still was like fitted enough, but not like, um, the fabric was pretty thick, but not to the point where you're feeling like a busted can of biscuits and you're like pouring out of the sides. Skims, I love you, but like it can be a little too tight. And this one, I, I felt like it was like just enough support. So, love, love that one. Emily, you've never worn a bodysuit. Why do you, why do people like them? I'm interested in buying some. Wow, really? Um, you know, I will say bodysuits are uh, made for, I don't like to like sit down for a long period of time wearing a bodysuit. I don't think they're comfortable. I think it's more of like a standing situation. Um, it looks nice when it's tucked in and more smooth um, to your midsection, in my opinion. I don't know. We're in this phase of, uh, of body suits. Um, this one halter neck one that I'm wearing right now uh, is the black. I do like it because I think that it's it's just a good everyday situation. Um, like I said, it's not like too tight on the sides, uh, but still to the point where you don't have to like, you know, wear a bra. And if you are just jumping on here, all these are under uh, $50. So, I don't know if I got a video in that one. Oh, good. Haley, I'm glad you like these. Um, yeah, here I am wearing it with like the little tennis skirt. Uh, these have shorts underneath it, so... I thought, like I said, these are cute for like, I don't know. Like I'm going to try to go to Disney and I was like, this could be a cute outfit to wear and like still take good photos, but be extremely comfortable. Okay. You're going to hear it here first. Um, Southern Charm Trailer. Can I tease anything? Well, you'll be hearing my voice a lot. If that can be a teaser for anything. I'll let you kind of like guess what that means. Uh, yes, the body suits are thick um, and you would not need a bra. I don't even care if your if your girls sit to your belly button. I still don't think you would need a bra with this because they're like thick enough to where they kind of like hold it up. So it's looking like September. So probably once school starts to get back in, uh, the show will be airing. Uh, fingers crossed. That's when it is because I can't wait to see. Um, and yes, it looks like you guys are, you are guessing right, which I was like, what? So yeah, I'm excited. Okay. Square neck, uh, bodysuit. This is a, a little short sleeve one. I love this one. I think that it's just flattering, good for work. Um, good for anything really. I don't love to sh show my arms. Um, I've told you guys that before. It's just, I don't know. I don't love it, but I do like this, uh, top a lot. Okay. Recommend a brand of sandals that make you feel closest to being barefoot. Teeks. Okay, so T-E-E-K-S is how you spell it. Now, good luck finding them. Um, I'm sure if you go deep diving, you can. But me and all my girlfriends that have these, I normally just try to get anything skin toned. Um, and they have a wide range of that. So it's just like every color possible. Um, and I wear those nonstop. I like them because they actually just make you look a little bit longer because if you look barefoot. 
if that makes sense. Okay, now this little uh, split hem skirt, this is the one I'm wearing. We can show you in the video. I can stand right here. So like I said, it has a little slit in this one. Um, yeah, I love it because it's nice, but if you're short, you're gonna have to get a hint. I mean, or not. I just, yeah, I would prefer it like a little bit shorter. Oh, good. I'm glad you guys love it. Um, Caitlin, yeah, uh, Naomi's not on this season of Southern Charm. So, um, yeah, sad that she's not. Maybe, hopefully, she'll come back. We always wish for that, uh, the OGs to always come back. Do you and the cast feel like you need to bring the drama? I mean, we all understand the assignment, that's for sure. Um, so that's what you always have to take with like a grain of salt, you know, it's uh, understanding that would we really have such a vocal opinion about some of these things, especially to their face? No. Um, would I go and tell my sister or my best friend what I think? For sure. But, yeah, I wouldn't be commenting on a lot of this. It, yeah. Well, maybe. <laughs> you know me. I don't know. I don't want to get in trouble out here. Okay. Um, we got a tennis skirt on here. I showed you a few times. Cute. Has little shorts underneath it with a little slit. Um, I do like it. The only thing I don't like about it is the fact that there are like rouging at the top, um, which kind of make it look a little cheap to me. You can't see it in that photo, and we'll see if you'll be able to see it in the video, but if you see that little thick line right there, not my favorite. That's why I kind of preferred uh, this other skirt that I'm wearing. But, you know, it's athletic, so you could wear that, like I mean, playing pickleball or whatever you do. Um, jean shorts, I like a Goldie and I like Levi's. Um, this next pair of jean shorts, I'm going to show you a little video. It's the crossover, the one I told you I wasn't crazy about. It's okay. Um, it is what it is, but... Do I know any of the Real Housewives of New York? No, I don't. Um, I don't know any of them. People are asking me what I think of Kyle and, what, how do you say his name? Marcia? Mauricio. Mauricio. Uh, I think, I think that's sad because, I mean, you know, if they are going through whatever they're going through and they can't do it in private, you know, that sucks because um, I know stuff like that happens all the time. And they were the only couple that I was like, okay, you know, a couple can actually survive through this reality, you know, TV world. Um, but I understand what it's like to go through that and I couldn't imagine. So um, I feel for them for sure. Okay, um, let's talk about this little tote bag thing. You know, it's it's like a knockoff of the Prada one. I'm not mad about it. I think if you walk real fast by everybody and your arm was covered over it, nobody would see. You know, you just, like, it's not bad. I mean, who, who in their right mind is going to take a Prada bag and drop it in the on the ground at the pool or um, the beach. I guess someone who just has you know unlimited amounts of money. But let's be real here. I still don't think that's worth it in my opinion. So I gave you guys a dupe. 
So when you have these glasses on in a black one-piece bathing suit and you walk past, I mean, are really people questioning, is that Amazon? No, they're going to say, that is so chic. Like, I love that. And these glasses, I think, are just super cute, everyday kind of vibes. Here's some hoops, too, that we can try on. I only have five minutes left, so I'm trying to knock out a few of these things. Um, what's been your favorite moment from the show? Oh, God. The end? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> um, my favorite? I don't know. Probably my, my wedding party. Okay, here's these two. They're like a fake Ray-Ban. Good to wear when you're like on a boat um, or you're doing something to wear. Like, like for instance, we went to the lake the other day and Hudson was wearing some of my Amazon glasses. And he went off fishing and kept them. And then he was like jumped in the water and was swimming with the glasses up in the air. And I was like, oh, you can get them wet. It doesn't matter. They're just Amazon. He goes, I wish you would have told me that. I've been like... I thought these were some $400 pair of sunglasses. I was like, oh, well, thank you. Please treat all my things like that. So, just saying. I'm glad you guys love the closet. It is fun in here. Haley, are Shep and Austin single? I think so. Yes. Um... Okay, these little studs, can y'all see them? I'm wearing them. Okay, the reason why I want to talk about these is because even though these are um, reasonable, I didn't want to say cheap, but that was, <laughs> they have a screw on back. So, or say if you, you know, you have a, a kid that you're like, oh, they always lose the earrings or whatever it is. Um, they have a screw on back or so if you're doing water sports and want to make sure you keep your earrings, that's why I would cut these. Have Austin and Brett met in real life? Yeah. They're fine. I mean, I, don't, I think we all know there's no threat there. Okay. This is the Hermes earring. Fake. So, <laughs> um, it says Hermes on the side of it. I know that's hard to see. Kind of cute. They lay a little weird, in my opinion. Um, I don't know. Definitely would not pay full price for that. Now, these rings I thought were awesome. They're like bands, and they come in a stack of three. So, um, I don't know. I just thought they were cool. You could put them on your middle finger. Like I said, good quality. Lord, we got some swollen. I went to Outback last night. So, now I definitely got a blooming onion. And, yeah, I don't know what's. Um, and then also this little necklace I got with the, the heart and H on it for Hudson. He loves when I wear stuff um, that has anything to do with him. So if it says Hudson nameplate on it, he's like, I really like that necklace. I was like, oh, thank you. So he is just the cutest. All right, guys. So if y'all, like I said, if you're new here, make sure you hit the follow plus button and you'll be notified every time that I go live. Um, if you guys love this, please let me know because we can continue to do things like this. And then that way you don't have to buy it and ship it back. Uh, cause I'm here to tell you, um, you know, the honest opinion, don't get the jean shorts, everything else add to your cart. If that makes sense. Just returned from Charleston. Never get tired of the city. Ooh, yeah. Uh, Mm, yeah, I've been here 13 years, so it's fine. How do I keep my closet so organized and clean? Um, well, I don't wear all the clothes in this closet uh, all the time because this is more like fancier stuff. 
normally in my primary bedroom, I wear a lot of that, that stuff all the time. So that's a little more messy. Um, and then these, I just kind of keep clean because that's like, uh, stuff I'm laying out for a trip or anything like that. Thank you, Anna, Lisa. I love you too. Thank you guys. Um, so much. And I think that's all for today, right? Okay. Well, I will see you guys next stream and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know I did and I will talk to y'all soon. Bye.